Hey everyone, it's Eric here from My525XL. Today is Monday, April 4th. I am just giving you a quick update on the tank. Um, I've adjusted the lighting this time so it's not so blue. Uh, as you can see from the sand, sand bed, uh, things are looking white again. So all the cyanobacteria and algae is gone. Uh, that took about, I think, just over two weeks to get rid of-ish, maybe more. Um, I was treating with the uh, Tropic Marin Bactobalance. I don't know if that is the sole reason everything's clear up because I did adjust uh, feeding as well. Uh, I don't typically overfeed, but um, I kind of scaled back on the pellets that I was using because I know those can always be a big contributor uh, for phosphates, but uh, everything looks pretty good right now. Um, I did do some additions in terms of livestock. Uh, so you can see the fox face here. He's uh, new in the tank as of about a week ago. Uh, finally had them in stock, so I took the plunge. And I also replaced my torch coral there. <laughs> this guy just wants to get in the picture. Um, I can't remember the name of this one. I'll post it here when I find it. <laughs> uh, but that's looking really good. Seems to be acclimated quite well. The rest of the corals are doing great. Florida Recordia is nice and puffy and uh, Fabia down there. Um, everything looks pretty good. Duncan is just uh, exploding still getting bigger man anyway um so that's all good i'm still dosing with uh, all for reef tropic marin um all my parameters are stable so that's good i think the corals appreciate that as well um but everything else looks pretty good the other thing i got back finally was my um max spec skimmer pump pump and controller so Coral view support did confirm that it was the controller that was the problem. So I don't know if they repaired it or replaced it, uh, but they sent back the controller and the pump to me. Um, total time to get this out there and back is a little discouraging. Uh, I was over two weeks, I think, right? I had to literally ask or run around trying to figure out how to get this thing shipped. The reseller didn't tell me much. Coral view says they don't cover shipping. Um, so finally I got a hold of the reseller and he was able to get a shipping label for me to send down because it was two months old, right? And then, you know, it takes three, four days to go down there, three or four days for them to look at it and respond and three or four days to get it back. So a little lengthy in my opinion. Some of that can really be trimmed off from a, a customer service perspective, uh, a little discouraged, but nevertheless, I've got it back. So it's up and running, just getting dialed in now and, uh, and we'll go back to normal there. So. Other than that, uh, not much to report. I'm happy that the algae's gone, so the tank's looking pretty clean. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to continue with the back to balance. Um, I'm going to do some more reading on that. I'm not big on dosing all kinds of stuff. I'm doing the Alpha Reef right now, which is great, but um, that's it. So, anyway, I uh, just wanted to take the opportunity to thank everybody that chimed in with their suggestions. Really appreciate it over the last couple of posts. Uh, always love hearing from you guys. Um, any questions or comments down on today's post, just leave them down below. I'll be uh, happy to respond as soon as I can. Uh, and until we talk again, stay safe and happy reefing.